Hello guys, it's Lena. Welcome to this first slime storytime video with Brianna Mizura. Let's get right into the video. Enjoy. Mommy, what's this? You can either be dating or married at 20. Oh, well, I want to be married. That's very young. I know, but I want to be just like Cinderella and marry my Prince Charming. I'm definitely going to have to set up an arranged marriage for her. Mommy, this just came on my finger and it's not coming off. That's what happens when you pick the married option. You may not remove the bandage until you turn 20 years old. Talk to any cute princess tonight? No, ever since this appeared on me, no princess will talk to me. Dang. They're probably just afraid of marriage. Yeah, I guess. If they won't talk to you, that's their loss. Thanks. Wait, you have one of these too. Oh, yeah. How did I never notice that? I guess since I'm a guard, you just don't pay attention to me. <laughs> you can remove your band-aid. I know. I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prints I get. Sissy, I'm scared. Hey, it's okay. I know this vacation home is a little creepy, but mom and dad will be back home from their party soon. And besides, my danger meter, it's only at 2%, so we're good. <laughs> Sissy, I'm gonna do a trick. Are you watching? Uh-huh. Yeah, good job. I'm almost at the top. Millie, get down from there right now. <laughs> Millie, I'm serious. Okay, I'm co- <laughs> It's gonna be okay. Crap, my phone is dead. My arm is hurting. You know what? I saw a hospital down the street. I'll just take you to it. We think her arm might be broken, so we're gonna take her for some x-rays. No, I don't want to. It's okay. I'll be right here waiting for you when you get out. It'll be very quick, sweetheart. Come on. Okay. Hey, I've been waiting like 45 minutes for my sister to be done with x-rays. What's taking so long? We're not doing x-rays today. Our machine's under maintenance. Wait, what? Then where do they take my sister? I'm not sure what you're talking about. It's what my dad would want. You picked the prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate, and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine. I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. What? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? <gasps> Hello. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. My soulmate controls my hand or my clothes? I've heard some weird stories about people who chose hands, so I'm gonna go with clothes. Please pick me something good. A party dress? I have school today, so there's no way I'm wearing... This is some sort of joke, right? I'm not wearing this to school. Why isn't it coming off? You may not remove their outfit. Hey guys, look at what this girl is wearing. Sweetie, prom's not till next month. <laughs> that is not school appropriate. Detention. But I didn't choose to wear this. My soulmate made me. Too bad. Excuse me, are you okay? I'm so mad at my soulmate. I can't take this outfit off and I already got detention for it. And I'm freezing. Here, take my jacket. Thanks. What clothes would you want your soulmate to pick for you? I don't know, like jeans and a t-shirt. Today I swear he better not... Those are the clothes that I told to that guy. Get adopted by a race car driver or a billionaire? I'd be kind of scared something would happen to the race car driver, so I'm gonna go with billionaire. Who'd you pick to get adopted by? Oh, I chose a billionaire. You got that as an option? My choices were a garbage man or a teacher. That is so not fair. Whoever it is is gonna think she's weird anyways. She'll be brought back. This is the man who's gonna adopt you. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. First things first, you're gonna need some of these. What are these for? A lot of paparazzi follow Mr. Knight. I'm his assistant. Hi, I suggest you put those on now. Mr. Knight, is this your new daughter? This way, darling. Your house is really nice, sir. Oh, thank you. What's that? This is a list of things that I wanted to do with my new parents. Are you married? Actually, sorry, kid. No, I'm not married. That's okay. I'll just adjust some things. I don't know about this. People are loving that you adopted her, and as soon as they write enough good articles, we'll bring her back to the adoption center. What is yours but mostly used by others? Huh? 
Mom, what is this riddle? It's happening. Answer it quickly. Do it. Okay, okay. What is yours but mostly used by others? Think, Giselle, think. Your name. Yes, I got it right. Good job, honey. You got your first riddle right. Okay, but can you please explain to me why I had to answer it? Everyone is given riddles to answer, but if you don't answer correctly, you die. Giselle, what do you think about the riddle system? I think it's so stupid. I got my first riddle this morning. I just got a riddle. Okay, what is it? It's, what has to break before it's useful? What has to break before it's useful? I don't know. Time's running out. Say something. A glow stick. They're really killing people. What comes up but never comes down? Can somebody help me? Please be an exciting family. An ordinary family? Who wants to be in an ordinary family? No. Lady Anne? How dare you speak to Lady Anne? Whoa, what are you guys doing? Guys, it's okay, she's my friend. I chose to be in a royal family. These guards have to protect me at all times. Wow, that's so exciting. Hey, babe. Um, hey, Jake. I almost didn't recognize you. Where'd you get the new outfit? I chose to be in a rich family. They have hella money. Wow, lucky. Did you choose your family yet? No, I've already declined two families. Giselle, you only get three chances to choose a family. If you decline all three, something bad happens. I didn't know that. Well, you better accept the third one you get. Yeah, okay. Please be a good family. I don't want anything sketchy. A mafia family? That is the definition of sketchy. Please have the red heart. Please, please, please. I forgot the red heart. That means I'm the prince's soulmate. Hey, mom, guess what? Giselle, is, is that the red heart? Yes, it is. I'm the prince's soulmate. Do you know what this means for us? Yeah, it means we'll be set for life. Go report it immediately and don't tell anyone. Jessica, I need to tell you something. Okay, so tell me. I'm not actually supposed to tell anyone, but I'm going to tell you because you're my best friend. Come on, just tell me. I got the red heart. I'm the prince's soulmate. Giselle, that's not good. What do you mean? Why? It's rumored that something really bad will happen to the prince's soulmate. You'll disappear. Wow, I had no idea. You have to cover it. Nobody can know you have it. Yeah, I will. Thank you. Did you hear the news? What news? Jessica's on her way to the prince. She has the heart. No, that's impossible. What? Why? Because I have the red heart. You can only say no. No! Honey, do you want some breakfast? No! But it's your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes. No! Are you okay? Should I call a doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a day to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's gonna ask you. No! But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming! No, 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 no! Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No! Whatever, I'm out of here. No. Why were they in the trash? The better question is, why are you making me take them? I know they're not really vitamins. How do you know that? I just... I just know, okay? Damn it. Derek found you, didn't he? Who? Never mind. You have to take them. No, Mom. I'm going to school. Don't tell me no. You will take them. I know what's best. Open your mouth. No, you... You stay back. Oh, You are in so much... I know I have powers. Honey, you don't even know how to use them. <laughs> yeah, I do. Just watch. <laughs> Come on. Work. Ow. I'm sorry, Kara, but I have to do this to protect you. Oh, okay, just stay there. Can you hear me? Mom. It's all right. Open your mouth. Mom, no. <clears throat> Kara? <clears throat> yes, my plan worked. Hey, it's all right. You're safe now. Dad? Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. What did you get on your math test? Oh, that? Yeah, I got an A. Well, show me then. She's gonna find out I'm lying. Okay, here you go. Oh my goodness, it says A. Wait, it does? 
I mean, yes, of course it does. I'm so proud of you. Hey, Giselle, do you have a date to prom yet? Shit, no, I don't. Um, yeah, Jake is coming with me. There's no way. Giselle, are we still on for prom? Yeah, of course. Wait, how? Told you. Okay, something's definitely up. Let me try this. I have an Apple Watch. What? All my lies are coming true. This means I can literally have whatever I want. Hey Giselle, do you want to come shopping with us? Yeah, I am a millionaire after all. Wait, what is that? Oh no. Please be a good guy, please be a good guy. My soulmate's danger level is a three? This is not good. Uh, hey mom. What's your soulmate's danger level? It better be zero. Yeah, of course. It's a zero. Good. You know what would have happened to you if it wasn't. We don't allow troublemakers into our family. Yeah, I know. I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Is something wrong? You seem worried. My soulmate's danger level is a three. <laughs> now it's a four. Why are you so worried about that? My soulmates don't allow troublemakers in our family. If they found out my soulmate was dangerous, they'd get rid of me too. It keeps going up. I need to find him and figure out why he's so dangerous. Class, welcome our new student, Zach. Wow, he's kinda cute. I heard he's a bad guy. He's been expelled from three schools. In life, you must take what's rightfully yours. You see, since you're royal blood and I'm not, you're to take the throne at 18. And we can't have that happening, now can we? Poor helpless princess, should have just eaten the food. After all, that's how I got rid of your father. <laughs> what, you didn't think he just mysteriously passed away, did you? Oh! You little- Hey, get away from her. Who set you free? That would be me. The prince told me of your evil plan. Looks like he was right. Here, princess. That's illegal. So is trying to kill the princess. You are no longer queen. Would you like to take her words? No! You had infinite words, yet you were still taking words from me? Take her away. Congrats on becoming queen. Thank you for everything, and I know this might sound kind of silly, but I feel like you and I are meant to be together. Actually, you took the words right out of my mouth. Ready to see your soulmate letter? One, two... <gasps> what? Cover it up. Does the letter F stand for something that I don't know? Never mind about your letter, we'll just cover it so no one can see it. It's fine. But, Mom... Don't argue with me on this one. Here, wear this glove for the ball tonight. But if I wear this glove, how is my soulmate ever supposed to find me? He won't. But that's not fair. Why won't you just tell me what's wrong with this letter? Enough of questions and complaining. I am the queen and what I say goes. Now, if I see you take that glove off one time tonight, you will regret it. Care to dance, princess? I don't really feel like dancing. Oh, come on, princess. It's a beautiful night. All you gotta do is take my hand. Ow! My glove's on fire. Whoa, uh, hang on. I got no, it. No, no, wait. That was weird. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Hey, is that your soulmate letter? Because I think I... No, please don't look at that. But, princess, I... Aspen, where is your glove? Four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the... Achoo! No! At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is going to want to come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't want to come to your party because she doesn't like you. Are you sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you. How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now, get out. Ugh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey, babe, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. He doesn't- Hi. We're looking for the daughter of a billionaire. I'm sorry. I think you have the wrong house. Mom, went to go deposit your new dad's money. Be back later. Seriously, Mom? Well, I guess it's up to me to call the- Wait a minute. Cops. Don't do that. Put the phone down. How did you two get in here? You left your back door open. 
Well, you better stand back because I am highly trained in the art of origami. <laughs> Isn't that paper folding? I was kind of hoping you guys wouldn't know what that was. <laughs> Relax, we're your bodyguards, your father sent us. Oh yeah? Then why was he pointing his weapon at me? I told you to put your weapon away. Whoops. Sorry, he's new. Well, your father wanted us to give you this. He also wanted us to give you this. He's gonna use it to call you. Dad? Hey, kid. It's so great we can finally see each other. I get to pick whether I'm gonna have a baby brother or a baby sister? Pick sister. But I want a baby brother. Are you the one delivering the baby? No. Then pick sister. Fine. She's here. Hi. <laughs> no, don't cry. It's okay. <laughs> Give her to me. You're holding her wrong. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Your little sister needs toys. You're way too old for that anyways. Ready? Catch. Ow! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you in the eye. <laughs> My baby. What did you do to her? It was an accident. <laughs> yeah, right. You know what? Go to your room. Your sister needs a blood transfusion. What? Yes, it's a really long story, but I told them you would donate your blood. Come on, we gotta go to the hospital now. Wait! You need to donate your blood to your little sister. Come on, we have to get to the hospital now. Wait! Okay, honey, let me see your arm. Samantha! I'm sorry, I can't do it. You know I have a fear of needles. Your little sister needs your help. Ma'am, we cannot force her. Maybe you want to donate? Yeah, why don't you donate your blood? After all, she's your favorite. Okay. I'll remember this. Mommy and I are going on vacation. What about me? You're staying here, you have school. We'll only be gone for two weeks or so. Two weeks? But what about food and- You can drive and here's money for food. Now say bye, sissy. Bye, sissy. I used up all the money mom gave me for gas for school and now I'm starving and there's nothing to eat. Sorry you missed me. Leave a message after the beep. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Officer Bloom. Your neighbors have reported this house. Are your parents home, sweetheart? Hmm, who are your parents? Well, my parents are... Wait, dear. Actually, allow me. bippity boppity boo Daughter of Rapunzel and Flynn. Um, actually, it's Eugene. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. You'll be needing this now. What is that? Dear, this is a high school for good and evil. This is how we track your behavior. Oh. You better get to class. Hi, I'm Ruby, daughter of Snow White. It's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Amelia, daughter of Rapunzel. Oh, I'm a big fan of your father. Could you help me hold my books? Of course. Thank you. Hey, so question, who are all those guys over there? Amelia, those are the villain kids. Don't make eye contact. Would your hair happen to be magic, love? Oh, feisty. I'm sorry, love. I shouldn't have touched it. <laughs> What's the matter? Did you figure out who my father is? Why did my scale move towards evil? Maybe because you have a crush on a villain's son. Why did my neighbors report my house? My report says that they heard a young female crying for over an hour. What's the matter, sweetheart? My mom, she went on vacation with my little sister, but she's not answering. Okay, how about your dad? We're not really in contact with him anymore. Listen, you're not in trouble, but would it be okay if I take a look inside your house? That's our pantry. This is all baby food. Yeah, so all that stuff is for my baby sister. Alright, but what about your food? I gotta report this then. Wait, um, is my mom gonna get in trouble? Because if that's the case, I take back what I said. She did leave me, like, a little bit of money for food. Relax, everything's gonna be okay. Officer, I can assure you I am not neglecting my daughter. Do you think I could have a word with her alone? Go right ahead. You called the cops on me? I'm sorry, I didn't. The neighbors did because- Shh. Do you want to take care of your baby sister by yourself? Then tell the cop what I tell you to say. Maybe we're not soulmates. No, your highness, wait. My curse, it's- You can't tell anyone about your curse. It's what? I can't tell you unless you tell me to say it. I'm such an idiot. Your curse, it's to do everything you're told, isn't it? Yes. Wait, but then why did you slap me? You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. Oh. You have to tell me to kiss you. Oh, okay. Well then, um... Oh. Stepmother, you just knocked out the prince! Yes, I did. And with any luck, he'll wake up with amnesia and forget all about you. You can't do that. Yes, I can. And you both are getting locked down here. Go to sleep. No! <laughs> Goodbye. 
Oh, Alina? Alina, wake up! Hey. Alina. Kiss me. Tell me to do something. Uh, jump up and down. Hey! It worked! I'm free! Yes, we're soulmates. Your Highness, we received your distress signal. Let go of us, you fools! Alina, attack the guards! Yeah, that's not gonna work anymore. <gasps> No, you kissed the prince? Yeah, I did, and it was really nice. Also, I'll be taking this back. You know I loved you, right, Alina? Goodbye, stepmother. Wait! No! Sorry, ladies. Alina is making her own choices now. I'm the son of Sleeping Beauty. You should know that my hair's magic isn't as strong as my mother's. It doesn't matter. Now say the words. I'm running out of time. Make the clock reverse. What the? Step away from the princess. Pirate. Jack. Hello, love. Hey, what do you think you're doing? It's called winning, mate. Hey! Is that Snow White boxes you have on? Shut up. Oh. Oh. Just wait until my parents find out what you did. I owe you an apology. My scale was not moving towards evil because you were evil. It was moving towards evil because I was judging you based on who your parents were. I'm sorry. It's alright, love. My father, Captain Hook, does have quite the bad reputation. I'm just glad that you're safe. Hey, you're bleeding. It's just a scrape. Must have happened on my climb over here. Well, I do have magic hair that heals, so why don't I just sing the song? Well, wait just a minute, love. Because I reckon your lips are going to be a bit busy. Mom, where are we going? Mommy, Sissy's talking to you. Sissy needs to rest, honey. Just ignore her and watch your show. Coco Melon! Hello? We're here. Okay, there's your daughter. Go ahead and carry her inside. Karen, she's 17. I'll just wake her up. Come on, Samantha. Hey, wake up. Let's go inside. What the hell is wrong with her? Look, she wasn't gonna come, so I... Karen, are you kidding? Mommy, who's that? He's no one, honey. Just watch your show. Actually, sweetheart, I'm your father, and you guys are coming with me. No, Daniel, we agreed. You take Samantha, and I keep Susie. Besides, you left us because you didn't want kids anymore. Well, now I'm changing my mind after seeing what you do to Samantha. No. Yes, I want my daughters back. You can have one. How about none? Because I called the police. You what? Patty cake, patty cake, bake those men. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Girls, I just wanted to say thank you for giving me a second chance. Yeah, you know, ever since mom has been out of the picture, I've actually really appreciated the fact that... I chose to have a baby sister. I love you, sissy. I love you too. Aw, group hug. Four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the- Achoo! No! At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna want to come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't want to come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you? How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now get out. Ugh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. More behind the scenes of my chaotic filming. <gasps> Please, you have to tell me to kiss you. It's still bad. It's because the line is so cringy, I can't say it. Well, it's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Rapunzel, daughter of... What? <laughs> I said the wrong thing. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock! It was at this moment that he knew. We're told we have to do what we're told, but surely. <laughs> Sometimes you have to be a little bit naughty. <laughs> really, babe? The mafia? You know, you're sorry. <laughs> I know a play we can a play? <laughs> I know a play? <laughs> Alright, bet. But <laughs> I'm so sorry. I bet. Wait, what is my line? I bet. But we gotta be careful who we can trust. <laughs> Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Okay. <laughs>
Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to my date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? Two years? Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so... Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please. Look, let's just all settle down. You just... I think I'm gonna need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet. I have, the people who trust. I have something that can help with that. Pick a language to speak until you meet your soulmate. English or Spanish. I mean, everyone I know speaks English, so... Surprise attack! ¿Qué te pasa? <laughs> Why are you speaking Spanish? Esto es su culpa. Oh, you must have been picking what language to speak today. Mamá, tenemos un problema. Honey, did you pick to speak Spanish until you kiss your soulmate? How did this happen? Well... Ella. It was an accident. I'm sorry. Aw, oh, it's okay, baby. Seriamente? Oh, stop. You'll be fine. Go to school. Don't worry, bestie. I speak Spanish. I can translate for you. Sé que... Gracias. Hey, girly, I gotta do something. I'll be right back. Just wait here. Por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Sorry, girl. I don't speak Spanish. Por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Are you speaking Spanish, girly? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Hey, I couldn't help but hear you said your head was hurting. Sí, ¿puedes entenderme? Sí, hablo español. I can understand you. Follow me. You said you need your medication. Where's your backpack? I... Okay. ¿Te sientes mejor? Did the medication help? Sí, gracias. So, you can't speak English at all right now? And you won't be able to until you kiss your soulmate? You never know, maybe you and I are soulmates. <laughs> Isn't that the girl whose parents like, died at sea? Yeah, yikes. They're not dead, they're gonna come back. Oh, really? Yeah, and when they do, they're gonna bring back the lost pirate's treasure. <laughs> My mark is gonna change. Well, be sure to call me when your zombie parents come back from the dead. <laughs> hey, don't listen to them, you're gonna be okay. It's easy for you to say that. Your whole family has yellow marks. Look, just because we're rich doesn't mean we're... Mail delivery. Kayla, what's that? It's a card and it's signed by my parents saying that they want me to meet them at the Golden Ball. Sounds like a trap. No, I know my parents' handwriting. Only yellow marks can get into the ball. Well, then I'll just have to change my mark. Wait, what? You are so lucky I have yellow paint. So, uh, yeah, we just gotta trust the process on this. Dude, hurry up, I hear cops. I'm going as fast as I can. Well, then I'll just have to change my mark. Wait, what? You are so lucky I have yellow paint. So, uh, yeah, we just gotta trust the process on this. Dude, hurry up, I hear cops. I'm going as fast as I can. Hey, you two, let's see your marks. Huh, have you guys seen any blue marks? No, sir. No. Good, because they're not allowed around this side of town, so if you see any, let us know. Will do. I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. The thing is, they won't just let anyone into the castle. We have to convince them that you're royalty. But how would I do that? I have an idea. Come on, we're going shopping. Are you sure this outfit isn't too much? No, I think it's perfect. It shows the queen that you know how to dress like a princess. If you say so. Wait here. The queen will see you in just a moment. Hey, it's gonna be alright. She'll remember you. Grandma, I thought I'd never- See me again. I've heard it all before. Tell me something that only my Annalise would know. Well, I can't exactly do that because a lot of my memories got lost, but 
I remember you. Stop. My heart can't take this anymore. She's just another girl pretending to be my granddaughter. Take her away. No, please. I came all this way to see you. I'm sure I can remember something. Let's go. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. Let her go. I need to get something to show her. This was one of the few things that survived the fire. I had it restored. I bought it as a gift for my granddaughter. You couldn't have known about that unless... It's me, Fanny. Oh, Annalise, it is you. I recognize your eyes. I'm so sorry. I begged the gods to go look for you. It's okay. How are you alive? What happened? I can barely remember. Sweetheart, can you remember anything about what happened to you? What your name is? What your parents' names are? I don't remember anything. We have a code red. So you survived the fire and woke up in a hospital with amnesia. I am so sorry, but what's important is we're together now. Grandma, I actually wouldn't have been able to find you if it wasn't for him. Oh, really? What is your name? My name is Eric, Your Majesty. I can't thank you enough, Eric. Why aren't you a handsome young man? Ah, uh, thanks. It is my honor to restore my granddaughter's title of Princess Annalise. Long live the princess. I think I just had a memory of me being a princess. Sorry, I know that sounds crazy. A princess? Wait, did something happen to your memories? Yeah, actually, when I was younger, some sort of accident happened to me. I don't remember what, but the doctor told me that I have amnesia. Some people still think the princess is still alive. They do? Yeah, and actually, I'm one of those people. You know, I could take you to the queen if you really think you're the princess. No, that's okay. Uh, I really should be going. At least take my number. If any more of your memories come back, call me. I can't believe that guy thought that I was a princess. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsed! No! Grandma? She left me. Oh, my head. Hey, I got your voicemail. You got another memory? I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Everything's fine, sir. I want to talk to her. Ah, uh, sorry, she just fell asleep. Thanks to this brat, Mr. Knight is getting suspicious. You're not gonna get away with this. Mr. Knight is gonna find me. <gasps> it's him. Stay calm. I will handle it. Mm, so I can assure you, everything is fine. Help! Wait, don't open that- Madeline? I'm sorry, sir, but you're supposed to be in love with me, not her! You're my assistant. But I wanted to be more than that. You're insane. Both of you, get back. Susan and your fake uncle have both been arrested. I thought I'd never see you again. I am so sorry this happened, Madeline. But I promise, as your father, I'll protect you from now on. Father? So, you still want to adopt me? Aw, oh, kid, of course. I mean, after all, we've got that list to finish, right? And look what I found. I love you, Dad. Madeline, I... I love you too. We're soulmates. I don't even know your name. Oh, right. My name is William. I have a canoe we can escape Not in. so fast. You take my son. I'll take the girl. No! William! Where are we? We're on Skull Island, Princess. In the exact spot we were all cursed. How much of my blood do you need? To break the curse, we need all of it. Father, no! You stay away from my daughter. Dad? I told you he was alive. Take all of his crewmates into custody. Turn around. Wait, I was trying to help her! No, wait. Spare him, please. That's my soulmate. Gods, leave him. Yes, your majesty. Dad, I thought that you were dead. How did you find me? I gave you that necklace for a reason, love. It's a trap. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? You really thought you could hide from us. Let me see your arm. This won't hurt a bit. Since you're one of the last fairies, we need to do research on your blood. Uh, don't be such a baby. Doctor, I think you may have taken too much blood. Let me see. She still has a pulse. She's fine. We need the pixie dust from her blood. Time to wake up. I feel really weak. That's because all your pixie dust is now in this necklace. You'll be dead soon. What? Yes, I'm afraid we've drained all your power. And fairies can't survive without their pixie dust. I'm sorry, dear, I can't hear you. 
Dad? Luna, I had a feeling they would take you. It will be okay. I'm going to get you out of here. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You are the reason there's no more fairies left in this school. Wait! Oh! Quickly, take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna! I have to go help them. Where's Daddy? Sorry, honey, but Daddy's getting interrogated right now. <laughs> I have to get in there. Hey, where do you think you're going? Hey, boss, look who I found. Well, well. It's gonna be okay. Yes, girls, stop struggling. Everything will be fine. For me. Actually, no, it's not. Because I may not be a chef or have graduated from college. But there's one thing that I didn't put on my resume that's uh, about to come in real handy right now. And what's that? How did you- I'm a black belt in Taekwondo, bitch. Lucy. Girls. It's okay. Lucy, is everyone all right? Yeah, Lucy saved us. You're hurt. I'm fine. Thank you. Daddy, does this mean that Lucy can stay? Yeah, I just hope she can forgive me for being so. Now they have to get married. Yeah, or at least give her a raise, Dad. <laughs> Maybe I'll do both. You know what to say. Mm -hmm. I want to be a sea doctor. Sugar baby! What? No! Where did you learn? Why would you say that? Sissy told me to say it. <gasps> Elizabeth! It was just a joke. But, but, she said that I will make a lot of money. Is that true, Mommy? Uh, I mean, yes, but no! No, you will not be doing that. Hey, look, it's Sugar Baby Girl. I was six, okay? Cut me some slack. Well, I heard Ashley's rich dad is single now. You guys want to hook up? <laughs> <laughs> they probably will. Stay away from my dad, creep. I don't care about your dad, Ashley. People are just spreading rumors about me. Besides, your dad's kind of, um, a jerk. No offense. At least my dad didn't leave me. What did you just say? You heard me. Do you know why you're here? Because I punched Ashley in the face. Yes, but I gotta say, she deserved it. Wait, Principal Richards, are you being for real? Please, call me Steven. Dad? Kara, you look so grown up. Yeah, no shit. You left when I was eight. I was forced to leave you, Kara. I was being hunted. Hunted? By who? Ultra, an organization set on eliminating our kind. It was your mom's biggest fear that you would become a special. A special as in having special powers? Yes. We think you might be the most powerful out of all of us. I don't think I can trust you guys. I don't even know how I got here. All of us specials are connected. Somehow you knew subconsciously to teleport here. My dad was a special too, and Ulta killed him. And they would have gotten me as well if it weren't for your dad. Please, I just want to keep you safe. Specials have either teleportation, telepathy, or telekinesis. We think you have all three. Okay, so how do I learn how to use them? Now use your telepathy to put a number in Derek's mind. Are you saying five? Yes. She really has all three powers. I want to try teleportation now. Hold on, that one's hard. I just want to try it. Kara, wait. <laughs> Honey? What is this? A niceness score? I'm gonna have at least like a 90%. 40? How is that possible? I'm like so nice. Hey, I'm back from kindergarten. What do you want, you little brat? I want to show you what I made. Is that slime? Yeah, I made it for you. You did? Uh-huh. Yeah, I hate slime. But it's your favorite color. Get out! Hi, excuse me, I would like to buy a ticket to prom, please. I'm sorry, but your niceness score is too low. What? To purchase a ticket, your score must be over 70. So you're telling me that I don't get to go to prom because I'm not a pushover like you? <gasps> Detention! This is so unfair. Hi, sissy. Wait a minute, how do you have a hundred percent? Cause I'm kind. <gasps> I need you to teach me your ways. Now remember, sweetheart, don't lose that oxygen can. Yes, I know, mom. And I'm setting your oxygen amount on private. But why? Because other kids will probably get jealous. Now take a sip before you go. Hey, where did you get that special canister? Oh, um, my mom got it for me. How nice, but girly, why is your oxygen on private? Um, can you show me how much you have? I'm not allowed to. What? Why not? I have to go. Hey! Angela, catch! Give it back! Hmm, no, I don't think we will. Guys, please, I need that. Then make your oxygen public right now. Okay! Why do you have so much? It's because I have asthma. Yeah, right. You do not need all this oxygen. No! 
here. Have fun with your asthma. <laughs> <laughs> no, this can't be happening. Would you like to take Angela's oxygen? Good morning, honey. Hola, mamá. Buenos días. Uh, why are you speaking Spanish? No sé. Oh, your soulmate, eh? I forgot. Today's the day. Whatever language your soulmate speaks, you'll speak. You won't be able to speak English until you find them. Today, we'll be learning about... What? ¿Puedo ir al baño? Huh? English, please? She's trying to ask to use the restroom, and she can't speak English because... Mi amor. Because of her love. Her soulmate, actually. He speaks Spanish. Oh, because today is soulmate day. See. Si. Well, tough luck. You should have used the restroom before you came into my class. Someone wants to interview you for an internship. Uh, ahora mismo? Yes, go. It's a once-in-a-lifetime chance. So you can only speak Spanish right now? No siento. No, it's okay. I'm gonna bring in a translator so I can understand you. Gracias, señor. Hola, señorita. Te ves hermosa. She is beautiful. Aw, oh, thank you. Hey, he must be your... In life, you must take what's rightfully yours. You see, since you're royal blood and I'm not, you're to take the throne at 18. And we can't have that happening, now can we? Poor helpless princess should have just eaten the food. After all, that's how I got rid of your father. <laughs> what, you didn't think he just mysteriously passed away, did you? Oh! You little- Hey, get away from her. Who set you free? That would be me. The prince told me of your evil plan. Looks like he was right. Here, princess. That's illegal. So is trying to kill the princess. You are no longer queen. Would you like to take her words? No! You had infinite words, yet you were still taking words from me? Take her away. Congrats on becoming queen. Thank you for everything, and I know this might sound kind of silly, but... I feel like you and I are meant to be together. Actually, you took the words right out of my mouth. So, let me get this straight. You found me on the beach as a baby, holding this necklace? Yeah, honey, I know this is a lot to take in. Well, I mean, didn't you look for my parents? They, they could have been around somewhere. We did. We were the only ones at that beach. It was a private beach. But you know, I really do believe your future. And I think your real parents are still out there. Do you really think so? Yeah, I do. I think you should wear the necklace. What is going on? Dad told me the truth about everything. What? We agreed to wait until she was 18. <laughs> no, look, I know now that my future is true, and I think this might be the key to me finding my real parents. Give me that. No more nonsense. But that's mine. As your mother, it belongs to me. He told her everything. I know her transformation is coming. That's why I need you to get over here to help me with her. There is three hours until midnight. I cannot use up 10,000 words. There's something you should know. I'm not actually your mom. Am I adopted? <laughs> no, your real mom has been taken. I'm your mom's twin. Wait, what? Where is my mom? She was sent somewhere to be killed. You're lying. I'm sorry, it's because she didn't use up all her words. No. And thanks to me, you'll be taken away soon, too. My sister and I have a bad past. I'm just getting revenge. I work for the system, so if you can use up all your words by midnight, I'll let you save her. Okay, fine. Then I'll start by cussing you out, you maniacal little bit. No way you're finishing by midnight. I have a better idea. And they both lived happily ever after the end. I still have 380 words left, and there's 20 minutes until midnight. I am sick of reading. Wait, that rap song that Daniel Radcliffe did on the Jimmy Fallon show. I can do that. Artificial amateurs aren't at all amazing. Analytically, I... Take that, challengers, get a tune-up. Universal. Zigzag zombies zoom into the zenith. It's what my dad would want. You picked the prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate, and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine, I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. What? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? Hello. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. Which one should I pick? Pick the blue one. It's a really cool power. Okay. Good thing she can't read. Yeah, let's test her power. This is going in the trash. You're never going to see it again. No, give it back. Nope, it's gone. Look at this cash. It's working. 
Honey, I found more cash. She must have cried herself to sleep. She can never know about her power. I'm setting it to private, so only we can see it. Can you guys please just tell me what my power is? I'm 17. I think I'm old enough to know. We told you to stop asking about that. Go to your room. You're being annoying. Why are they always so mean to me? She's crying again. We're officially millionaires. Hey, what's up here? Why was this money stashed away and where did it come from? They tell me every day that we are dirt poor. Would you like to know your power? Hey kid, want some candy? Yes! Okay, just follow me over here and I'll give you some. Ow, you're hurting my ears! Ah, oh, come on, don't be afraid. Follow me. <gasps> Get away from her! We're leaving. I told you not to talk to strangers. I'm sorry. Where's your headphones? I lost them. You what? I just bought you those. Remember, whispering is deadly. Getting ready for school? Yep. If you hear any whispering at all... I know, I know. Put on my headphones. Mom, I got this. So, prom's coming up. Yeah. I was just wondering if you... You wanna come with me to prom? That's not funny! Aw, <laughs> uh, what's wrong? Excuse me? Brienne? Hello? I'm so sorry, Miss Sanders. See me after class. I'm confiscating your headphones. Oh, but my mom said- Zip! Hand them over, you'll get them back later. I want to show you a video before you go. Hi, you're watching ASMR. Why were they in the trash? The better question is, why are you making me take them? I know they're not really vitamins. How do you know that? I just- I just know, okay? Damn it, Derek found you, didn't he? Who? Never mind, you have to take them. No, mom, I'm going to school. Don't tell me no, you will take them. I know what's best. Open your mouth. No, you, you stay back. Oh, you are in so much- I know I have powers. Honey, you don't even know how to use them. <laughs> yeah, I do. Just watch. <laughs> Come on. Work. Ow. I'm sorry, Kara, but I have to do this to protect you. Oh, okay, just stay there. Can you hear me, Mom? It's all right. Open your mouth. Mom, no. Mm. <laughs> Kara? Yes, my plan worked. Hey, it's all right. You're safe now. Dad? 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 Kara, you look so grown up. Yeah, no shit. You left when I was eight. I was forced to leave you, Kara. I was being hunted. Hunted? By who? Ultra, an organization set on eliminating our kind. It was your mom's biggest fear that you would become a special. A special as in having special powers? Yes. We think you might be the most powerful out of all of us. I don't think I can trust you guys. I don't even know how I got here. All of us specials are connected. Somehow you knew subconsciously to teleport here. My dad was a special too, and Ulta killed him. And they would have gotten me as well if it weren't for your dad. Please, I just want to keep you safe. Specials have either teleportation, telepathy, or telekinesis. We think you have all three. Okay, so how do I learn how to use them? Now use your telepathy to put a number in Derek's mind. Are you saying five? Yes. She really has all three powers. I want to try teleportation now. Hold on. That one's hard. I just want to try it. Kara, wait. <laughs> honey? How many words, honey? I got a hundred. Remember, you have to use them by midnight or you die. I got this. I know. I'll be fine. Ah, uh, crap. I barely talked at all today at school. I still have 50 words left and it's almost midnight. I have an idea. This one is for the boys with the booming system. Top down AC with the cooling system. <laughs> boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 super bass. All words used. How many words today, hun? Zero? Wow, you lucky girl. How fun. You really got zero words to use up today? Well, girl, I got a lot of words I gotta use up, so you can just listen to me talk. So they all thought my score was fake. You're listening, right? Okay, good. So then my boyfriend was like, I am so sorry to do this, hun. I just can't handle all these words. Why would you do that? There is three hours till midnight. I can't use up 10,000 words. There's something you need to know about me. Hear everything my soulmate says, or taste everything my soulmate eats. The first one sounds kind of distracting, so I'll just go with the food option. Here's your coffee. Oh my gosh, thank you. Of course, sweetie. What's wrong? What was in that? Just coffee. It literally tasted like a raw egg. Soulmate was eating breakfast. Ew, gross. He has raw eggs for breakfast? <sighs> Today, we'll be reading... Yes? I'm just really feeling sick right now. Go ahead and go to the bathroom. Mm. 
I'm pretty sure whatever he ate was straight out of a garbage can. Hey, is my lip bleeding? No, why? I started to taste blood. Oh, maybe your soulmate is a vampire. <laughs> hey, your brother got into a fight. What? Yeah, follow me. Oh, oh. Josh, stop! What is your problem? This guy over here was hitting on you. That doesn't give you the right to do that. Get out of the way. Are you okay? Yeah, it's just my lip. Time to take your vitamins. Mom, do I have to? They make my head hurt. That means they're working. What exactly are they doing for me? Shh, open. Mom, stop. I can take it myself. Okay, let me see. Good job. Next one's at lunch. Yeah, okay, I know. You're going to make me late. Hey, cool if I sit here for lunch? Sure. Why does no one talk to you? Um, FaceTime from Mom. I'm really sorry, but I have to take this, um, in private. Mom, oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Look, I just need to see you take it. There, are you happy? Yes, good job, honey. I love you. Why? This is why I'm never gonna have any friends. <laughs> hey, what the hell? Where did you come from? They're after me. There isn't much time. You need to stop taking those vitamins. There. I think today I'm gonna go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? How did you find out? Never mind that, but why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about like uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No, why? Because I think I'm sitting next to you. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? Stop taking those vitamins. They're suppressing your powers. Powers? Yes, you're a special just like your father. A what? How do you know my father? I'm out of time. Just don't take those pills tonight and you'll see what happens. No, wait! <laughs> Okay, it's time. Good job, honey. You just earned yourself some dessert. She's gotta stop treating me like I'm five. Kara, vitamin time. Okay, I'm coming. Go on, take it. What's wrong? Kara, don't tell her anything. She can't be trusted. Honey, what? Uh, nothing. Never mind. Uh-huh. Well, don't be late to class now. Bye, Mom. No, Kara, wait. I found your vitamins in the tra trash. Hey, I said you're about to get caught. Come on, let's go. You're a seeker. You're trying to trick me. This mark is fake. If I were a real seeker, you'd be knocked out by now. Just play along. What? Shh, don't say anything. Well, well, what do we have here? You caught a hider, huh? Yeah, she was a hard one to find, but I finally caught her. We were just leaving, actually. Nah, she's not going anywhere. Don't touch her! <sighs> Um, are hiders allowed to fight back? No, not really. Run! Oh shit. Quick, in there! Whoa, wait, what is that? An underground tunnel I made. Now come on! I am not going down there. I don't even know if I can really trust you. I've gotten you this far, haven't I? We have to go now. We'll be safe down here. Why are you helping me? Because... You... Who gave you that necklace? My sister. Since you're a chef, can you make a sushi? Yeah, whatever you girls want. Yay. Yes! Hi, I just want to order some sushi, but I need it delivered out back. <laughs> Don't you dare snitch on me. Mmm, this is so good. Well, I'm glad you like it. Daddy used to cook for us, but now he's too busy with his job. Yeah. You know, what is your dad's job anyway? <laughs> We're not allowed to say. Who made this? Oh, that would be me. Hi, I'm the new nanny. And who are you? I'm Darren's girlfriend, and I'm allergic to sushi. Throw this away. Just go in the other room. It's not bothering you. Ow. Hey. <laughs> it's fine, honey. Darren gave me permission to discipline the girls. Are you okay? I have to tell your dad about that. Don't bother. He, he won't believe you. She acts different around him. Excuse me, sir. Lucy, hey. This is for you for being so great today. Now, if you'll excuse me. Is that a gun? Is that a gun? 
Oh, you weren't supposed to see that. <laughs> Why do you have that? What is your job? Listen, Lucy, if you're gonna work for me, there's some questions that are off limits, and that's one of them. Excuse me? No, I want to know that I'm safe here. You are very safe with me, Lucy. I promise. Actually, sir, I came up here to talk to you about your girlfriend. What about me? Hey, babe. Hey, baby. Yeah, what about it? I was just gonna say that she's gorgeous. Darren already knows that. Don't you, babe? He didn't listen, did he? No, not really. I told you. Listen, girls, don't worry. I'm gonna find a way to expose her. No, baby, he's just a job. You're the one that I love. We'll talk later, okay? Bye. Lucy, you didn't hear anything. Oh, but I did. No, you didn't. That's a lot of money, huh? It can all be yours. If you keep your mouth shut. Join a dating program or go to prison? I guess I'm joining a dating program. Finding you boyfriend based on your internet search yeah, history. that's not creepy. Ready for your date. You know what? Why not? I hope you don't mind paying for the bill. Yeah, sir, you can give that to her. I forgot my wallet. Ooh, excuse me. You can actually just take this and keep the change. Goodbye. Wait, what? Finding another match. Thank you. What's up, girl? Did it hurt when you fell from heaven? I'm sorry, no. Just, just no. Finding new boyfriend. Please let it be someone decent. Hey, I'm Damien. Hi, I'm Danielle. <laughs> you seem cold. Here, take my jacket. Thank you so much for the jacket. No problem. Wait, what's in your pocket? Please, don't be anything crazy. I hope you didn't get a bad curse, honey. All right. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I told you to clean this room, honey. I just a baby. Just because you're the youngest doesn't mean you don't have to clean. I just a baby. You and I, we're just not working out. I can buy myself flowers. I'm sorry. I guess I'm just a play date to you. What the hell are you doing? See, this is why I'm breaking up with you. Is that your report card, honey? Let me see. Hand it over. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I need to see it. Let me tell you something.